Tunubu and I don't take P to be seriously. We are not even worried about this phenomenon. FFK, welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel to get notified when we post hot juicy news updates. Please click on the notification bell. Chief Femi Fane Kayode, FFK, spoke about two presidential aspirants in his recent interview on BBC News Pigeon. This aspirant are the former governor of Lagos State, Asiwaji Bola Ahmed Tunubu of the All Progressives Congress, and the former governor of Anambra State, Peter Gregory B. of the Labour Party. Chief Femi Fane Kayode said, and I quote, Asiwaji Bola Ahmed Tunubu and I do not even take Peter Gregory Obi seriously. We are not even worried about this phenomenon because I keep asking myself, where will he get votes from? Speaking for that, the former aviation minister, who is now among the presidential campaign council, PCC, of Tunubu and Shetima said, I think the social media youth are, re are interested in P2B, but when we get to the polls, I see P2B's aspiration like fantasies. He will likely do better after his presidential election crushing defeat. All right. Lastly, FFK was assigned to define loyalty and he said loyalty is when someone is loyal to his convictions and core beliefs. I also see loyalty is something important in a political party, even if the decision taken by the party is not entirely pleasing to the member. Now, let me say this. You see this particular issue? If he's not worried then, why are you coming out? Nobody's asking you if you're worried about him. You and Tenobu, you are not even worried about him. Nobody cares to know, sir. So sorry. But Nigerians do not care to know. They don't care to know whether you are worried about him or not. Secretly, Obi is not in the race. I recently traveled to four northern states only in Benin, Cardinal Capital. That's one out of ten people know Peter. No Peter. Obi, no billboard, no posters, and no other candidates in his party going for any other post, like Senator, House of Representatives, or something else. He is not sure for him at all. Well, I keep saying it that this means that a lot of work still has to be done. Oh. Peter B's people, make una do it in. Make una continue to the work. Okay. Have you traveled around the 36 states? So in those four states you traveled, no labor party sign for some. It's like you followed Bush. No, 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 no. This is not the right way to go. This is the time where you tell people where they walk, say, eh? Then they try, but make them do more. Okay, I've traveled to all the Nigerian states in the past, but at this period of election, I've traveled all the southwest state capital, Kora state, both capital, and few towns, and four northern states, Niger, okay, Niger, Kajuna, Kastin, and Kano. You can see Labour Party posters very few in Bida, Safa, Suleja, and Mina in Niger state, Kakuri station, Kabal, and places in Kaduna. Where you can find Labour Party publicity. In Kano City and Castina, just in various county places. If you doubt me, take it all. What is you online is opposite in reality. Obi is not even pushing in reality like he does on social media. Social media is just hype and hypocrisy. What you order for versus what you received. Obi's social media popularity cannot translate to victory. I don't understand. Those things are post. So it means saying and waiting. What does it mean? He meant that he, 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 it is, <laughs> oh my goodness. Now why? You hardly talk about this election without mentioning the B. It is only what gives a man concern that you will hear him mention always. Sir, please, such a conscience we all understand. Hmm. These people are really suffering panic attacks because of a B.O., why are we talking about someone you're not worried about? Exactly. We have up to 18 candidates, but you chose to talk about the one you're not worried about and left the ones you're worried about. It shows that you have been used, your brain has been used for. Ah, no, that's too brutal. Please, locate the Mountain of Fire Omega Power Ministry for deliverance ASAP. All right. Then why are you always feeling feverish at the thought of his name? The very center point of a campaign for the People Democratic Party and the All Progressive Congress has been to be. Can anyone deny this fact? Now, let nobody lose their sleep. A book shall be opened in 2023 and the names of all the old politicians shall be wiped away forever. A new Nigeria is possible. Obidati, I hope for a better Nigeria. 
Okay, me, I am of the opinion. If you are not, see, the thing is, whether I like it or not, if you are coming out to say something and say you are not, uh, you are not d- defending whatever, or whatever, the thing is, whether, as you start talking about it, it is no longer the fact that you are not scared. All right. Um, when people are oppressed and enslaved and they still want to re-elect the oppressors and enslavers, then just know that the oppression and enslavement is divine. Okay. They will get from your mother's spots. You all know how to, all you know how to do is to go to TV and social media, backing like a dog without seeing any reasonable thing. You don't need to take a be serious because you don't have serious agenda with your serious... All right. Mm. Is there anyone listening to this come and chop man? That should be the most jobless person on it, Abba. All right. Forget FFK. He's making sure he eats sustainable money well before the man faces the reality. Huh. That is going to be your greatest undoing. Come 2023, you will not know what hit you in the coming election. It is quite comforting that a loser like you called FFK or whatever they, whatever they call you should be so blind that you cannot read the hard writing on the wall. Very good indeed. The coming elections shall concern people like you and your sponsors. Tenembo or Atiku to the dustbin of history and ignominy where you rightly belong. You shall tumble never to rise no more. Wait for it. It is coming. So the thing is, if they are so unbothered about P2B, if it is if it's not bothering them, they're not losing sleep over him, then should I say they're in love with him? Because you only talk about what you love. If you're going to hate someone and you keep talking about them, the thing is, I think something just clicked. If you claim you don't like someone, but you keep talking about them, then if you check it, well, you really like that person. It's just like you have not come to terms that you like that person. Or what would I call it? Huh? What should I call it? Somebody should help me here. Okay, I am still saying that campaign should not be talk nonsense about your failure experience, but bring out what you have in bring to better this country. And that is it. The APC and the PDP, they are losing it. They have not still come to terms with the change we have had in campaign. You know, previously, campaign used to be all about come out and they market this opposition and you come out and attack this opposition to demarket them. And that is what it is all about. But with someone coming in, like the third force coming in, we have not known better that campaign should be all about telling us what you have. You know, I want to believe that something is bringing you out for the presidency. You, don't, you did not just wake up one day and decide, oh, I want to be the president of Nigeria without having something. Okay, I want to do this particular one. Let us better this particular sector. So tell us the sector that you want to address their issues. Tell us how you have found, you know, tell us how you're going to go about this problem. Tell us the solutions. That is what we want to hear. It is like sell yourself in an interview because these people are all seeking for the job of the highest the highest job in the country, which is they want to be the president of Nigeria. I mean, all presidential candidates. I think they should not even be interested in, in an interview. You don't pull another candidate down. You don't do that. There, there is not even going to be time for that. You are going to be too focused on, you know, presenting yourself, selling yourself, showing that you bring value and you're going to bring value to the company or the organization. That is what you should do. That is why whenever I hear these people come out and they're always, oh, this one will not do better, this one cannot do better. I'm like, ah, this is not what we mean. These people have not, they are finding it difficult to come to terms that we have left that part of that type of campaigning. Well, Nigerians, is up to us. Are you going to vote for someone who have not told you what has in, are you going to buy a product you don't know its benefit? Hmm? Are you going to buy a product you do not know its benefit or are you going to buy a product that you know is better fit? The choice is ours to make.